All right, another episode of Ace Combat. I think we're on to mission 17 now. Only two more missions to go after this. Cutscene. Good stuff. The island we went to was supposed to have been secured by the ground forces. They hadn't gotten a handle on things by the time we got there. So now we were stuck in the middle of a half-assed campaign. My job was to get the planes ready for combat, making repairs and handing them over to our troop of cons. Thing is, the enemy still had the hangars. The comms were still down, so none of us knew what the hell was going on. The last transmission I heard before everything went to shit was that some prisoners from an Ocean military penal unit rioted and managed to escape. They stole some jets and now they were flying around, taking out their former allies left and right. I wonder if any units like ours were out here, creeping around. Hearing the Ocean jets firing at each other overhead chipped away at morale. Since the radio was out, it was quiet. I liked it better that way. All I heard was the gunfire. Here we were, walking around carrying rifles. We were pilots, damn it. Friendly fire will probably kill us. You know things are desperate when the guards that used to lock us into solitary are now telling us it's better we all stick together. I guess they think our odds of surviving this war are better that way. After walking for miles across the battlefield, we came across the wreckage of a plane. Passenger, not military. I knew that rose. It was an erosion liaison plane. The guard's dogs smelled something and took off. They led us to a cliff. And the bodies. Today, I lost everything. When Osea attacked our capital, my father, a man who was never really suited to being the king, was killed. Mm. I was to be flown out of the war zone to safety, but the plane was shot down by rebels. The entire crew was killed in the crash. Soldiers appeared and one shot at me. My dog went after him and shot him to pieces. He was my best friend. After all those speeches I gave, about working together for peace. I thought everyone felt the same as I did. <gasps> I'm sure the soldier who shot at me knew I was the princess of Arugia. He was Arugian too. More soldiers have come. Now, there is no one left to protect me. I am so numb, I cannot move. Watch as one of their dogs approaches. It sniffs mournfully at my dead friend. I wonder if it grieves for him as much as I do. It's very poetic. It really is. I can barely mournfully. feel weaker by the minute. I don't <laughs> okay. know who these soldiers are with, but I managed to take a sip of the water they gave me. How long have you been here? Somehow, I muster the courage to answer the woman's question. I tell her I've been there three days. They gather around me with grim looks on their faces. What would they do if they knew I was the Erosion Princess? After searching the cockpit of the plane, the woman who spoke to me before came back to me. This is an air-to-ground tactical radio. It still works! Noticed she walked with a limp. She knelt down next to me and asked her companions to give me some food. And then, very softly, she said, You see, I used to listen to your broadcasts, Your Royal Highness. <laughs> Just what did you see here? Oh, sorry to break up that emotional moment, but I guess it's time to start the mission. Homeward, ooh. Alright, let's see what we got today, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, enough talk. <clears throat> Your opinions have all been taken into consideration. Beyond the seizure of Forbanti, which is important, 
and supporting the Erujian officer. At this point, I just don't know what our strategy is, or what our mission will be. Radio communication is still patchy for both the military and civilians, so we're getting zip from mission command about our orders. Still, with countless Erujian forces in the area, it's too dangerous for us to stay around here waiting for a miracle. Now, regarding Count's suggestion to think about self-defense, <coughs> uh, I think we should make a break for Tyler Island. It was a large Ocean base before the start of the war. Count says his previous squadron took part in an operation to seize control of the island. It has the only base that will get us to the space elevator without refueling. It's also a transport facility for supply ships that provide drones and ammo for arsenal birds. For the Ocean forces that are looking to <coughs> reclaim the space elevator, those are two great reasons in its favor. If everything went according to plan, the base may already be in allied hands when we get there. Though based on what Count told me about the island operation, it won't be easy to seize control. If the ground troops have managed to open the bridgehead, the transport route to Osea for supply ships should be available. So much at stake, I can't imagine Arusia just giving it up without a fight. Things could really have gone bad. Even if there are enemies left, they should be pretty easy to suppress. I just want to go home, man. Me too. With that look on your face, Trigger, I know exactly what you want to do. <laughs> sure. If Trigger's ready to kick ass, then so am I. Oh, yeah. Damn straight. We're with you, Trigger. It's like they know. It's decided. I just want to Let's fly and shoot airplane. some Call stuff down. That's all I want to do. The Arsenal Bird's anti air network, there's still remnants from the Erusian forces. I want to get to the island without getting into any unnecessary <clears> combat. <throat> Pick a fast craft and fix it how you want. Pack for a long trip, but remember if you drag your ass, you'll get left behind. Yeah, that's all I want to do is just fly and shoot stuff. So uh, let's see, we got our dudes here. More dudes. That's it. <laughs> Let me check out the aircraft tree. See what we got to uh, unlock here. I got some cash. Ooh. Let us unlock something good. Typhoon. The Rafale. Hmm. Let me get some of these uh, other ones here that I decided to ignore. The uh, SU-33. The Flanker. And the Foxhound. Not so sure I want to unlock any of these. Oh, wow. That's just, um, yeah, you know? Hmm. Oh, wow. That's a lot of points right there. Uh, you know what? I might as well just round out things. Let's, uh, unlock these, uh, these planes here. I think the, uh, it's a Sukhoi. That's what that is. The SU-33. I'm not, again, not a, not a plain guy. So, um, yeah. All right. Oh, I don't have enough. Oh, well. You know what? Let's just unlock these weapons. Come on. There we go. What is this again? Electromagnetic launcher. Okay. And uh, pitch mobility. <coughs> Upgrade those. Uh, oh, yeah. There we go. Do I have enough cash to uh, up, uh, unlock those? Uh... Yeah, I think I do. Three, six... Oh, wow. Oh, wait, no. Oh, yeah, no, I still have enough cash. Just working my way down the tree. <clears throat> and I do not have enough money. No more. Oh, wow, that's nice. That's nice right there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, 
All right, cool. Just uh, taking a look at that. Let's start the mission. And uh, I'm going to stick with the uh, FA-18 Super Hornet. It's my go-to. Uh, I don't know which one, though. Air to air or air to ship. We'll just go with air to air for right now. And um, let's go. Squadron, <coughs> squadron, sortie ASAP. Well, loading up this new mission. Hopefully, I think it's air to air, but um, oh, it might be air to ground. <laughs> well. Guess I'll just have to shoot them down with the regular missiles, I guess. Should've, maybe should have chosen a, um, uh, like an A-10 or something, maybe. Ground attack, you know, kind of stuff like that. This is Tango 2-3, pursued by multiple tanks oh, and yeah. APCs. There are ground forces. We'll go down if we don't pull back the landing craft. And what? Abandoned Tango 2-3? Something's not right. Tango 2-3, we don't have the firepower to assist you. You're on your own. Please, we need help! Wagtail is on the Ocean landing ship. What's going on? What did you say? Multiple bogeys inbound. Damn it. Prepare for anti-air combat. We're friendly. This is the AWACS Longcaster. The aircraft in your area belong to the LRSSG. Allied aircraft. A retreating vehicle is taking fire. Requesting assistance. Roger. ID complete. Strata 1, target acquired. Shit. These are Ocean. Update us on Tyler Island. Ooh, nice. I love it. Did I miss? Really? Oh, that's a tank. Okay. It needs two hits. Boom, baby. Of the tanks. Oh, that's a drone. Baby, nice. 
Oh, oh no, oh no. Search every nook of the island. We're not leaving anyone behind. Oh, nice. Oh, come on. We can't afford to take any more damage. Get out there and do something. Oh, I missed? Really? Got Come on, give me an ID. Alright, let's see who this guy is. Forget it. <laughs> Just use the missiles. What's this one? Come on. I need an ID. Got him. Echo 13. All hostiles are down. All hostiles are down. Each other. Longcaster. We're uploading the latest ID data. Check your tack terminal. Come on, give me the give me the target. There we go. What? Oh no. Missile, missile, missile. Oh, we got some targets over here. Oh no, that tank's still alive. Good shot, huh? Sorry about that. Identification <clears throat> complete. It's erosion bombers and their escorts. Count's prophecy has come true. Take out all bombers. They'll flatten our allies. Bombers. More bombers. Casualties as well. Precision bombing is impossible in these conditions. Maybe they know they can't. Missile. We're gonna drop them all. Missile. Missile. Heads up. These reinforcements are elite. Missile. Trigger. Boss. Get over here quick. Missile. Bombers? Oh, I guess it's a bomber, right? Ah. I'm 
Come on. We're going to be slower than this guy. There we go. I got him, I got him. Watch yourself. These guys are working together to bring us down. Fox 2. Yeah, gotta pull up. I'm behind my target. Strata 1, target acquired. Only half the bombers remain. We can't let even one get away. Intercept those bombers. I'm trying. Be a nice target. There we go. Behind the enemy. Missile. Missile. Oh wait, that's not my target. Hit on bandit confirmed. Missile. Missile. My target. Where's my target? Missile. Oh, there it is. The bombers are about to reach the island. Shoot them down now. I got it. Hold on. Somebody please get this guy off my tail. Got him. All enemy bombers have been destroyed. We did it. Continue with your mission. Come on. You're low on missiles. The rest are here. But the first one go by and detonate on the second. They're starting to fire blind sight. But will we make it in time? A landing ship is waiting for you. Right. We leave the wounded. This will guarantee us a one-way ticket to hell. I'm sure we're there already. Please get on with this. <laughs> so I can uh people oh my goodness all these missiles Just don't stop Missile, missile, missile. Wait! What are you doing, dumbass? Here! Attack right here! On 
Lancaster. We've confirmed the location of the flare. That's them. Oh, goody. All aircraft. We just updated your threat matrix via data link. Take out those targets. Oh, uh, yeah. Don't miss. We don't want to hit the pretty ladies down there. Missile. Hurry. Missile. 58 seconds. Missile. Kidding me? Seconds. Oh, baby. Good job. Nice. Stop those. What's going on with that? Supply ships have been launched from the mass driver. If the supply ships make it to the arsenal bird, they'll be able to resupply it. They may be loaded with new weaponry that we don't even know about. We have no choice but to take down the supply ships before they can get within the arsenal bird's air defense network. You gotta hurry or you're not gonna make it. I got it. Don't worry about it. The enemy's air defense network. All aircraft, Missile. remain on high alert. We got Missile. bandits incoming on radar. Missile. You're gonna have to forget about Missile. them for now. Focus on destroying Missile. that supply ship first. We're Missile. sitting ducks like this. Let the supply ship oh, come on. Never be able to catch it. If we're too close, we're gonna get down. The target's using cloud cover to hide itself. Don't worry, we know where it's heading. You venture the clouds. Missile at the supply ship dead on. Expecting this to be easy, all they can do is fly fast. Oh, maybe. Next one. Did you see that explosion? Looks like that's one of them down. Remember, there are two supply ships four, out there. Hurry up and shoot the other four one missiles. Down. Four missiles. It needs four missiles to kill them. Ugh. Flying as fast as possible here, come on. Come on. Is that it? 
Do I have to fly somewhere? Nope. Okay, good. <coughs> All right, let me uh, let me get a nice uh, little. Uh, let's try a. Uh, Let's try another angle here. There was one where I flew over some smoke. Oh, it looked really cool. I think it was this one. Right here. That's pretty cool. All right, that's enough. <laughs> Use that as a thumb, uh, thumbnail <laughs> for the video. I might. I don't know. There might be some other shots in there that are pretty good. I don't care. I'm just glad that the mission, the mission, sorry, is done. And uh, yeah, <laughs> wait for this to load. And a little audio bug there, which is kind of take a seat. Everyone's here. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> Good work in sinking the supply ships, not to mention saving the refugees. However, we're in no position to start celebrating. Even the commander here is starting to fray from the stress. Can't say I blame him. Now, Tyler Island is in a state of complete anarchy. This base isn't safe either. The faces you see around <coughs> you are the only friends we've got. Take a good look. Is that it? Huh, a rank, not bad. I can do better. And there you go. That was uh, mission seventeen. S yeah, I think so. I don't know. <laughs> I'll see you guys later.